everyone! Today's topic is all about luggages. And here I'd like to share with you tips on how to prevent lost luggage during your travels. Yeah. Yeah. Lost luggage happens. It can happen anywhere, but it doesn't mean that it's the end of the world. So how can you safeguard your things? The obvious solution is to book a non-stop flight or pack everything in your carry-on. But clearly, this won't work for everyone. Fortunately, there are other ways you can avoid this worst-case scenario. So now I'm giving you tips on keeping your bags from traveling without you. Let's start. Number one, use more than one luggage tag per bag. The key here is to identify your bag in multiple places, from outside and from inside. Luggage bags get torn during the handling process, so having more than one on each bag you check will prevent a lost bag. Use the paper tags provided by the airline carrier in addition to your own. Be sure to include your name, your address, your phone number, which is very important, and your email so you can be reached while traveling. You can also put your destination address and your dates when you're going to be there in case the bag needs to be delivered to you. We go to number two. Label your bags outside and inside. Before checking your bag, label it inside and outside. Labeling bag is a little helpful for people who are looking for your luggage. However, this may be a big help when you need to claim them. Keep the stubs that you get during check-in as you'll need them if your bag goes missing. Also, keep a copy of your itinerary inside your bag so the airline workers will know where to route it in case they find it or in case they can't get in touch with you. Tape it inside your bag or put it inside an envelope labeled itinerary. We go to number three, take a picture of your luggage. Take a picture of your bag, preferably use a color tag and store it in your phone camera. Print it out and keep it with your passport in your carry-on or in your passport holder. If you have to report a missing bag, which I hope not, you'll have an easy way to show the lost luggage people what your bag really looks like. If you have it on your phone and with a hard copy, you can leave the hard copy in the baggage section or in the lost luggage section if you have to leave the airport without your bag. Also, take a picture of the inside of your bag or better yet, take a photo of the contents of the bag when you pack. Just lay everything on the bed and take just a few photos with your camera. Not only will this help you identify your bag when it goes missing, but it will also help with claim forms if your suitcase will never be found. It's also wise to take a photo of your baggage stop just in case you lose it. We go to number four, customize your luggage. Luggages, unfortunately, sometimes suffer a case of mistaken identity at the baggage counter. This is especially likely to happen when half of the people in the airplane travel with black luggages. To help better spot your bag, consider adding a little color to your bag. You can tie a colored ribbon or an identifiable tag to prevent it from being mistakenly snatched by someone else who's in a hurry. Or better yet, buy a luggage suitcase cover so you can easily identify your luggage. We go to number five, tear off old tags. Before checking your bag in, make sure that the old tags from the previous airline has been ripped off. Rip off any old baggage tag another airline may have put on your bag. These are the big tags looped around your suitcase handle with flight information on it. Always remove old baggage claim tags from your previous trips to prevent confusion about your destination. They do not only confuse the airport employees, but the baggage scanner machine as well. Before, during my ever first trip, I don't want to remove the baggage tags because for me, it's a souvenir. But of course, you have to remove it or else it, it confuses everyone. So tear off your old tags. We go to number six, use a carry-on. The best way to avoid lost luggage is to carry it on, but that's not necessarily convenient if you're heading on a long trip or you want to carry large liquids. Airlines usually allow you to carry on two bags, one day pack size bag and one that the airline will consider as a bag, a tote, or a purse. Check the airline rules before you fly, and if you're going on short trips, don't check your bags in unless you need it for your liquids and gels. We go to number seven, check in early to avoid luggage being delayed or lost. There are several reasons why the airline suggests passengers to arrive several hours before departure. 
And one of them is baggage. Travelers who check in late, whether they arrive at the airport with only minutes to spare or getting held up in the check-in counter, are more likely to get separated from their bags. Remember this, it takes some time for baggage handlers to transport the bags from the check-in drop-off all the way to the plane. Aim to arrive at the airport a couple of hours before your flight and more so for international flights and holiday periods. We go to number eight, go to the baggage counter quickly. Now you have to know this, there's always a possibility that your bags can be stolen off the baggage carousel. One baggage thief stole smaller bags and quickly placed them in a larger one to walk out with. Another took multiple bags and put it in a cart to help hide while he pushed them out. This is the reason why you want your bags to look different from all other black bags on the carousel and be there to claim it the moment it comes off the belt. We go to number nine, avoid tight connections. You should always avoid tight connections as this increases the likelihood of your bags to go missing. If your flight is late, which usually it is, the window time for the airport staff to transfer your bag from one airline to the next narrows. Siyempre, some booking sites sell domestic multi-leg itineraries with layovers of less than an hour, which doesn't leave you any room as the flights are always delayed. International connections can even take more time if you have to reclaim your bags, go through security, and check in again. For this reason, it's important to allow plenty of time, two or three more hours ideally, for international layovers and at least 90 minutes for domestic connection. We go to number 10 take a non-stop flight. If one leg of your journey is significantly delayed, especially in the first one, it's pretty much guaranteed that your bag won't make it on the next connection. It's all about math. Non-stop means fewer flights for something to go wrong. So take a non-stop flight if possible. We go to the last number 11. Travel insurance is the best guarantee that you'll recoup any losses. As soon as your baggage has been declared lost, you should immediately call your travel insurance company to ask for advice on what to do next. They may tell you to wait if the luggage is recovered by the airline, or they may reimburse you for any emergency purchases that you make while you wait. This may be toiletries, undies, clothes, or medicines. And if your airline refuses to compensate you for your lost luggage, your travel insurance will almost certainly will. So that's it. I gave you 11 important tips on how to prevent losing your luggage. Again, thank you so much for watching and sharing your time with me. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. Just click on subscribe, click the bell button, click the all, so that you will be notified every time I post a new video. As always, please take care and stay safe. Bye! Yeah. To prevent it from being mistaken sleep, to prevent it from being mistaken mistakenly. There are plenty of reasons why air there are plenty of reasons why air why, whether they arrive at the airport minutes before check off and be there to claim it the moment you claim it. Claim it. <laughs> if your flight is yay, yay. <laughs> if you're back huh, so that you will be notified every time I post a new video. Video. Number eight, go to the baggage queen quickly. Queen? Not a queen. Go to the baggage queen. Not a queen. Not a queen. Go to the baggage queen quick. Hi. Go to the baggage queen. Queen. What queen? Clean. 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 Go to the baggage queen. Quick clean. Go to the baggage claim quickly. Ah, good. Go to the baggage claim. Click claim. 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 Go to the baggage claim. Click click click. <laughs> click click. Go to the baggage claim quickly. Yes. Go to the baggage claim. Claim. Go to the baggage claim. Yes. Go to the baggage claim quickly to avoid losing your luggage.